Hello, hello, hello everyone, it's Deloaded here, and welcome to Surviving 2B2T Episode 12. In this episode, I'm going to be building a gold farm from scratch. I want to clarify that I have never... Well, okay, I've built a gold farm once, and it was probably like seven years ago or something, so... I'm going to be going with the only design I know how, and we'll see if that turns out to work or not. So I'm going to build this over water, and the reason why is I don't want to have to dig, basically. Um, I would much rather just put a bunch of wooden planks down and stuff. Um, I do have all this obsidian that I harvested from e-chests. If you are looking to get obsidian, the easiest thing to do is probably go to spawn and just mine up e-chests. Or um, you can like shave part of the highway off or something. I don't rec uh, obviously I don't want you to grief the highway, but um, if you need obsidian, that is, you know, that is an easy way to get obsidian. I hope this is enough. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so I don't think that's big enough. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Whatever. Probably big enough. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I guess this is the dimensions that I'm going to go with. The other thing to note about making one of these is you should probably make it um, substantially far away from your base. You want it to be far enough away that uh, it's not going to put your base at risk by having a portal right next to your base. I'm gonna do two blocks in between each portal. I don't know if that's necessary, but that's how I've done it in the past. And again, when I say I did it in the past, it was again, like nine years ago, seven years ago, so. I've been playing on TBTT and haven't needed to farm gold for any reason. Alright, welcome back. I've constructed six of these portals, and I don't know if this is going to be enough. I guess we're going to find out. But first I have to construct the structure below it that will funnel the uh, piglings into some type of kill zone. All I've got is wood to do this with, um, but it should be enough, I think. Major question that we have to answer is like, how far does the water actually flow? I think it's seven blocks. And we made this thing 15 across. So we may run into a little bit of a problem, a wee bit of a problem in a second. I guess we'll find out. Uh, let's do that. Okay, 
Okay, perfect. So that tells us... Yeah. That's fine. It's perfectly fine. Um... Okay. We need way more wood. What? Why isn't that one going as far? There we go. Brilliant. Amazing. Okay, I think this is going to work. We just have to finish this out. I'll cut back in in a minute. Okay. So, I kind of um, did most of the rest of it. And you can hopefully see what I'm doing here. The idea is that they will come out this portal. The basics of this are more uh, square inches of portal equals more um, piglings accidentally coming out of the portal. It's important to note that I don't think you have to build one of these on the nether side. You only have to build one on the overworld side. I don't know why that is. Uh, maybe I'm actually completely wrong about that, and we will find out as soon as I turn it on. But, uh, yeah, this is the idea. So, what I need is for, um, like, if I just do this, is that, is that gonna work? Hold on. Wow, it's pushing really slow. I don't think the current is strong enough. Yeah, that's a problem. That is a problem. Trying to figure out exactly how I need to do this. I know, like... There's gotta be a way. Maybe this whole section just needs to be lower than this. Like, substantially lower. Yeah. See, this doesn't really work. We need to figure out some way of getting the water to be more like, behave more the way we want it to here. 
See, like, this is, this is an issue. That I don't know how to fix. Well, that's obviously not. Hold on. That's obviously not going to work. Um... We don't want this stream of water to connect to this stream of water at all, because I'm pretty sure it'll fuck it up. I guess that's fine. And then over here we can do... Maybe it doesn't fuck it up. We're still mostly going the right way. This is a dead... this is a problem. that's a little dead zone. is that? Yeah, this is a problem. Shit. Oh, man. What was I supposed to do about this? There's gotta be, like, there's got to be a way. There's got to be a way. I need more wood. I need, like, way more wood. I know there's a way to do this. I think that we're gonna have to do some serious restructuring on this entire thing.
Okay. And then fix this real quick. Okay. Yeah. So there we go. Now none of the water is proceeding past the spot where we didn't want it to proceed. And we will just lower all of this by like one block down. And that will completely fix the issue, I think. I think, keyword. Okay, and not so bad. This is working so far. Okay. Perfect. So now, piglings will fall to their deaths. Well, not to their deaths. They're going to fall in this hole. And I believe the number of blocks a pigling needs to fall to die is 24. So that's, if we want them to die automatically, that's how deep we should go. I suppose we do. If we didn't want them to die automatically, we could also turn this into an XP farm. But we already have one of those, as seen in like episode 5 or something. So we're just gonna. Um, we don't need to do that again. Okay. Now we just need to make sure Yeah, this is what we wanted. Okay. some water so let's see one two three let's go down uh, 24 from here just to be absolutely certain that they will die one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty one Okay, uh, oh fuck, oh no. Damn it. Yeah, see, this kind of messes up. Like, I don't know how far this is anymore. Yeah, that kind of, that kind of fucked things up. Damn it, fucking bullshit. Sometimes you want to find a cave very desperately, and then when you don't want to find a cave, you of course do. Um, well, what's gonna suck is, if, if this is completely wrong, and this isn't actually how to make one of these things, and I turn it on and nothing happens, I would be very disappointed. <laughs> Because this has been so much effort. Let's light the portals.
Nothing's happening. I'm gonna AFK for a bit and just leave leave the camera rolling here and see if this improves at all. Or see if like see if they start to spawn. Okay, there's one. There's one. been probably 20 minutes 30 minutes something like that I'm gonna go check on this and see just how much gold we've got I know it has been working but it looked pretty slow to me um, I guess we'll find out I, I don't think it's gonna be much I really don't Oh my god. Wow. Okay. Well, <laughs> so it looks like in about two years you'll have enough gold for a golden apple. What the fuck? Well, I guess if you AFK'd this for hours, it might. Um, it might pay for itself. Or if you base, like, right next to it, like, if you build your house right here so that you're always in the vicinity and it's always running passively, then it might be worth it. But, um... I would have found more gold mining in a mesa biome. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching the episode, everybody. Like, comment, and subscribe. Please remember to share this with your friends. And thanks for watching.